Impact teams quickly realize that the goal is much more than providing clean water. Viva football! <laughs> I'm about to lose my lunch playing football. Thank you for the gift of sports. The goal is sharing life, building relationships, and ultimately making a connection that will introduce their new friends and teammates to Jesus. I really like sports. I mean, for instance, soccer. You can't win the game alone. You have to rely on each other. You know, you have to come together and, and nobody can be a ball hog. You're all struggling towards one goal, you know, and I think for us, it's a matter of what goal are we striving for. In soccer, it's obvious. There's a physical goal, you know, so everybody's striving for that. And it's easy to keep your eyes on that. But in real life, what's the goal? You know, what's, what is that box that you're trying to shoot for? To start off my testimony, uh, I grew up in a Catholic family. You know, that the goal was to bring Jesus, but the, the conduit for that, you know, the soccer game to get there, if you will, was the water project. So the water is, is a physical need that needs to be met, you know, with the ultimate goal that, you know, we be the hands and feet of Jesus um, and examples for Jesus and, you know, leave as, as big of an impact <laughs> as we can for the kingdom of heaven. It's amazing how easy it is to just be Jesus to a person who needs him. That's the goal of impact, to be Jesus through simply providing clean water to villages in Honduras. Then introducing them to the source of the living water. Impact is changing the life of a village and the heart of a man. Don't hesitate to learn more by visiting impactwater.org. I've ever played amongst this much cow dung before. <laughs>